Hello everybody, Backcountry Pipe here, and yes, that is a white dot on the stem, and yes, that is a Dunhill Flake, and yes, that is what is in this pipe, and this is my first Dunhill. Um, Dunhill, ah, uh, what can I say? It's smoking like a charm. It's a light. I believe it's a tan, uh, tan shell briar. Could be wrong on that one, but uh, it's my first, uh, my first Dunhill. I uh, paired it with a few pipes and uh, placed uh, a few with this uh, this beautiful Dunhill. Effortless, effortless draw, nice and light, smokes like a dream. I am, uh, I'm more than happy. And uh, first of all, I'd like to thank William for this. Um, if you never uh, checked out William's uh, shop, he is a, he has a pipe shop in uh, Denmark. He goes by, uh, let me get this right, uh, Williams Estate Briar Pipes DK. Some of you, I believe, have dealt with uh, William before, but uh, he's in Denmark. He sells used pipes new pipes. Um, I bought uh, my Bing Crosby pipe from him and now this Dunhill and uh, a real pleasure to deal with. I'm very very uh, informative um, and it's like you're buying a, a pipe from a friend. Uh, <coughs> it's a great experience. I'm very happy with this Dunhill. So uh, if you're in the you know looking for a used pipe, quality pipes, whatever, check out uh, William's shop in, uh, in Denmark. And the Dunhill uh, Flake Tobacco was sent to me from uh, Home Waters One, Olivier. So Olivier, thank you. Uh, it's a very, very tasty uh, Virginia plug. I guess we're not a plug. Virginia Flake Tobacco, and uh, <clears throat> I won't go do a review on it yet because this is my first uh, smoke in the Dunhill. Um, I've had it for quite some while, but haven't uh, haven't warmed the briar up on it yet, and uh, I've chosen that tobacco for the first bowl. So uh, effortless draw and very flavorful uh, tobacco. Great combo. So I'm happy. She's a good girl. Hopefully, uh, the first of maybe. Uh, another Dunhill, you never know. I've always uh, fancied the uh, Dunhill cherry uh, cherry woods, so you never know. So what's new with me? Well, I've been working a lot. Worked uh, 14, 12 hour shifts in a row, doing some vacation coverage, and uh, that's done. Uh, on the baby front, baby is due, uh, well, could be any day now. Mama is off, and uh, doctor's appointment today, all is good, so uh, with your thoughts uh, thoughts and prayers with us, uh, could be any time. It's officially due on the first. Um, I know first babies tend to be late, but it's anyone's guess, so I'm uh, super excited. So yeah, it's, uh, this time next week I may be a dad, we'll see. What else is going on? Well, I'll show you what else has been on my mind. You guessed it, fishing season is upon us. Another week until fishing season arrives and I've been going through the fly box. My uh, dry flies from the Nova Scotia Mayfly, the uh, Adams. I got some mosquitoes in there. Uh, blue Duns, 
Royal Wolf's. That's my dry fly box. And over here is the wet flies, the streamers, some Mickey fans, dark Montreal, some woolly boogers, uh, smelts, rainbows, just a mixture of streamers, muddler minnows, and such. Half of these I've tied, half have been purchased. But uh, that's what I've been up to, just kind of going through the fishing gear. <clears throat> Um, so yeah, it's, uh, I'm really busy, haven't made a lot of videos, but, uh, I haven't really smoked a pipe in quite a while either, this is probably, uh, I don't know, maybe my second bowl in a month, and I'm one-handedly going to try to like this, excuse me, I'm not really sad for this today, tonight. But it did the trick. Figure it's been a while, I want everybody to know it's still still out there. I haven't even watched uh, many videos. Say pretty much uh, working, getting ready for the baby, and daydreaming of fishing, which I'm not sure how much of that I'm gonna get in, but here's hoping. This uh, past week we've had quite a bit of snow and cool weather, lots of wind, so it's almost more like January, February than it has been March. Really, uh, really can't wait to the warm weather to, to get involved with cigars a little more and uh, enjoy some more stogies. Um, yeah, toss around the idea of uh, getting involved in uh, kayak fishing. I've been looking at some kayaks and uh, <clears throat> I think I'd like to maybe try that. Um, I do have a, a boat I go fishing with, you know, a aluminum boat and motor and all that, but it takes a little little time and now with this new shift, uh, people aren't readily available to go fishing with, so I thought kayak might be the, uh, the great route to, uh, to do some solo fishing at, at ease whenever I get some spare time, so we'll see. gone out again. It's, uh, I just don't put that tin, so I probably should have let it dry a little more, but I didn't, so. That's better. <clears throat> Boy, this downhill flake is uh, is really good. He said I haven't really smoked the pipe much lately, but uh, <clears throat> what I have smoked uh, been some really good blends that have kind of been new to me and really opened my eyes up to uh, Virginia tobaccos. Um, a lot of examples this this flake. I mean, mind you, it's it's my first time ever having the downhill flake, but it certainly is a quality flake. The Rainier Long Gold Flake is uh, fantastic. And I've also uh, also had some uh, Gross more. Anyway. I know it's probably a little long, but I uh, just want to make a video say hello. I'm going to enjoy this bowl, enjoy looking at my uh, my flies, and uh, think about uh, the new chapter in life that's about to happen here very shortly. So, hope everyone out there is having a, a good time. Thanks for watching, and I'm uh, not sure how much uh, time I'm going to have making videos, but I'll certainly try to make videos to keep everybody uh, up to date. So, cheers and thanks for watching.